From legendary musicians to family and friends, many are mourning the sudden loss of Russell Padiz Jr. He died of a heart attack on Saturday at 57 years old. So young, and today Lily Cummings spoke with his cousin, John Baptiste. You may have heard of him. Mm -hmm. He reflected on the last show that they played together. Russell Baptiste Jr. was a fixture at Maple Leaf Bar. Near the drum set he would sometimes play, you'll now find a shot of whiskey and drumsticks, small mementos to honor the big loss. Such a huge loss for our family. Such a huge loss for the culture. Russell's cousin and Grammy Award-winning artist John Batiste says the last time they played together was May 2nd at a surprise show at the Maple Leaf during the second week of Jazz Fest. When I was growing up, I would see Russell playing at the Maple Leaf with his band, the Orchestra from the Hood. And it was a full circle moment. I'm glad that we got that last one in. Russell inspired his younger siblings and cousins to pursue music. He was our kind of blueprint. He left a mark not only on Oak Street and New Orleans, but on stages across the world. He toured with the Funky Meters and played with countless other acts. Russell is an unsung genius. He's loved and beloved, but the stature of what he was in the world is equal to that of Prince, or, you know, the greatest musicians that we all revere. Russell was called the Young Lion. They had the family band, and he was the youngest in the band at the time with my cousin Damon. So, you know, the young lion, he just knew that he was, he was going to be something. And something he was. In New Orleans, Lily Cummings, Eyewitness News. Uh, he will certainly, certainly be missed. Well, tonight at 7 and 10, George Porter Jr. shows at the Maple Leaf Bar will honor Batiste's life. Also, the Batiste family is hosting a tribute tonight at Sweet Lorraine's. That's at 7 o'clock.